Hi, Earth Signs. My name is Debbie, and I'm an intuitive reader. And I'm here today to give you guys your bonus readings for all the Earth Signs out there. Hope you guys are doing well. Guys, don't forget to smash that like button, share, comment down below, as well as subscribe if you haven't already. So let's get into it here. We're going to first start off for the sign of Taurus. Ooh, right on out. I'm feeling that somebody is struggling. I'm feeling in, in regards to their everyday life here. I'm feeling that it's you guys. You know, it's kind of like every day is a battle. Uh, but it's the, the wild thing is, is that there's the sun. Now, this can definitely mean in every direction with work, with just, uh, you know, it's a touch of a little bit of depression, just a little, you know. But I feel that somebody's just run down and tired, you know, uh, of life, you know. And, and I feel that it's been a struggle for sure. Let me clarify that five of wands. That's kind of, I, I get it. Yeah. Yeah. Take one step at a time, whether that's with the... Uh, Overall balance of life, uh, it could be love. I mean, we're talking everything under the sun. Like, nothing seems to be going right with you. Uh, you know, I mean, I think we all go through those stages, you know. Uh, but definitely, it's time for that change to work on you, okay? It's time to uh, really, really focus on your energy. And um, not that you're not, but it, it's, okay, this is what it feels like. I get up, I do the same thing every day. Nothing changes in my life. It's very humdrum kind of energy. Uh, but yeah, no, that's okay. I get it. I, I think we all do it. Uh, but definitely it's kind of it, right. Uh, your perspective. I just heard change the way that you think. Change the perspective of things. You know, uh, in our minds, we have to change the way that we think sometimes. So that way we can actually live the way that we want. You know, uh, you, know you can have the option of, um, you know, uh, not taking action and, and and being kind of mad about your life or you can actually show the action you know what i mean but right now it's more so healing to and confidence and knowing that you can do anything that like my dad always used to say you can you can do anything that you put your mind to you know uh and i to this day i still joke around um i hate algebra to this day 53 years old and Algebra was a nightmare for me. Uh, and I still joke around. He's like, not out, al not algebra, you know, not algebra. But no, there are certain things that we can't change, you know. Uh, but other things we can to improve our life, okay? And that's what I feel. You need a whole new perspective, a whole new outlet. It's like analyze your life when you think about it and say to yourself, what can I change? Whether that be love, whether you need a vacation, whether, you know, house projects, fixing things up, work. Uh, you know, doing something that you enjoy, buying a pack of yarn and crocheting, something different in your life. I'm a big crocheter, sorry. But yeah, uh, but something that you enjoy that will kind of give you that spice back, you know, the rice back in the spice again. You're, or you know what I mean. <laughs> sorry. But yeah, that's what it feels like. You just need that umph to get out of that mood set because things can improve. You know, it's wild because you're not even looking at the sun. You know, you're looking at the five of wands, which is the everyday humdrum of life. And like I said, we go through it all, you know. We need that change in our life. And fives are known for that change. And then you got the death card. So focus on some type of change that you can brainstorm in your mind in fixing things. Because things, it's right behind you, the sun. There's a solution. You know, it's known as the yes card. There's improvement coming in your life, whatever that may be, okay. Wow. Okay. That was strong, Taurus. Virgo. Don't give up hope on a relationship here. There will be work. There will be a new start in regards to it. Ground your energy. Yes, they're being quiet, but things are definitely changing. You got the nine of pentacles looking at the eight of pentacles. Looking at the Four of Pentacles. So, yeah, a little quiet, a little stubborn. Could be dealing with air sign energy. With that King of Swords, I apologize. Every time I, I video, my next-door neighbor is doing something obnoxious outside. <laughs> oh, he turns it off now. See, he heard me. Uh, but anyway, in regards to Virgo, in regards to this relationship here, things are not done. Do not get discouraged. Give it some time, okay? Okay. Uh, there's going to be work. For some, I do feel with the 
air sign energy of gem, you know, uh, King of Swords uh, and the nine here. I'm feeling sometime in September with that nine for sure. But I do feel that I just heard come clean. There will be communication and breaking through that barrier of being quiet. So I don't know if they heard me or not, but I don't care. Capricorn. <laughs> Capricorn could be dealing with fire sign here with that five or that uh, king of wands. Somebody I just heard is not settled. I'm feeling that it's your counterpart. They're not, they're not happy. They're not settled with how things are going. Wow. Who did I just do? It was Taurus. Very similar energy. So you could be dealing with the Taurus. Seriously. You got the sun. You got the king of wands, five of wands. And the, you got all the same cards as Taurus. Uh, Taurus had a little bit more, but still very similar energy here. So you could be definitely dealing with Taurus. If not, check that out for sure. Uh, but yeah, and I, I feel that somebody is not settled with their decision of um, ghosting. Okay. I really feel that they want to return and they want to come back. But, you know, I feel that they're mad. They, they're, they feel that you are mad at them. And I feel that that's kind of struggling with their decision to um work on this to act on this no i feel that you would eagerly take them back okay uh ace of pentacles i feel that things could be smoothed over if given the chance but they really need that encouragement here leo energy does not have to be uh but definitely there's definitely new starts of balance with this they're going to have that encouragement basically they're going to um get past that energy of I'm a little nervous because I know that they're mad and they're going to get past that and they're going to start over with you once they have that new start of bounce for themselves first. And then they're going to have a change here in fixing things and making things right because they don't like the way that things ended or ghosted or took place here and it bothers them. That's a lot of air sign energy right there. Uh, but definitely I feel that they want an improvement here for sure in this relationship. So... That is what I have for not just Capricorn, but for all the earth signs out there. Thank you all for watching. I truly appreciate it. You guys rock. Have a good one, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.